78,312. The number of Husker faithful packed inside Memorial Stadium for the annual red white scrimmage today. That's the second highest attendance for the spring game in program history and plenty to keep an eye on today in the Big Reds 15th and final spring practice. And it wouldn't be Nebraska football without the tunnel walk. The Huskers taking the field for the spring game and the red team moving the ball nicely early on. Patrick O'Brien got the start, but this is Tanner Lee. The quick screen to DeMornay Pearson L for a pickup of 17, which leads to Drew Brown's second field goal this afternoon. Pure from 33 yards out, red team in front six to nothing. But just before the end of the first, the early enrollee freshman Tristan Jebbia looking impressive. The 25 yard strike to David Engelhop. Jebbia threw for 268 yards on 45 attempts today. And a few plays later, the freshman calls his own number. Jebbia keeps it on the play fake for the first touchdown this afternoon. White team jumps in front 7-6, but the red team responds. Divine Zigbo powers his way up the gut for the score. Red now ahead 13-7. Next white team possession, a guy that's earned some serious praise this spring. And here's a reason why. Wyatt Mazur staying on his feet making people miss for the first down but the very next play a freshman mistake Jebbia to his fellow Calabasas Coyote Keyshawn Johnson Jr. He's stripped by Luke Gifford who recovers right around midfield and the red team offense takes advantage. Tanner Lee out there dropping dimes. A 30 yard touchdown pass to J.D. Spielman. Red team leads 20 to seven. And just before the half, more for new defensive coordinator Bob Diaco to smile about. Jebbia picked off by Luke Gifford with a one-handed snag and showing off some wheels on the nice return. Sets up this easy touchdown toss just before the first half comes to an end. Patrick O'Brien finds Mikhail Wilbon from nine yards out, strutting his stuff on the way to the end zone. Red team up 27 to seven at the break. And the red team rolling to start the third quarter. Tanner Lee rolling out to his right, has all day to find his tight end. Jack Stoll for the nine yard touchdown, makes it a 34 to seven red team lead. Fourth quarter now, more from Wyatt Mazur, now on the red team, diving across the pylon for the five yard touchdown run. The red team adding on to its lead, now up 41 to seven. Later in the fourth, a Tanner connection. Tanner Lee to Tanner Haas for the 11 yard touchdown. One of three for Tanner Lee on the day. Now 48 to seven red and why not score some more? Jebbia switching jerseys from white to red and gets the TD to show for it. 11 yards, one more time to Tanner Haas and that the final score of the spring game. So the final score, not all that important today, but the red team takes home the bragging rights 55 to seven. And just like that, spring workouts in the books for Nebraska. Three News Now Sports Director Adam Kruger has the full report from Memorial Stadium. It was a beautiful April afternoon here at Memorial Stadium as over 78,000 Husker fans watched the Nebraska spring game. And of course, all the talk was about the quarterbacks. Tanner Lee threw for three touchdowns on Saturday while Patrick O'Brien threw for one. You know, they made the, the maybe not always the best throw, uh, but the right throw. Um, in, in what, I don't know what the percentages were. It seems to me like it must have been pretty good. Makes a catch. Touchdown, Nebraska. I was joking with some of the guys the first time I played in front of a big crowd that was on my on my side. Seriously. So it was a lot of fun. I felt comfortable and um, you know, it was just a lot of fun. It felt good to get back out there. I feel like I've done my job and I can control what I can control, you know? And uh, I mean, I just got to go out there and perform the best I could every single day. And if that means that I'm going to be the starting quarterback, that means and if it doesn't, I mean, obviously I'm going to be disappointed, but um, I mean, I just got to control what I can control. I think we had a really great spring and uh, we have a lot of things to build on. And I think we got, um, a lot of our offense in and made it look really good. And uh, I think we, uh, not where we want to be, but I think we're, we're laid the foundation to build for that for the fall. After the game, Tanner Lee was asked what he'll think about between now and the fall. He just said he's focused for now on his final exams coming up. Reporting from Memorial Stadium, Adam Kruger, 3 News Now Sports. Thanks, Adam. Now taking a look at the spring game by the numbers. A whole lot of offense from both sides this afternoon. 574 total yards from the red team, 349 for the white, and a total of 48 first downs between the two squads. And the Huskers through the air today. The early enrollee freshman Tristan Jebbia played for both sides today and led the way in completions, attempts, and yards. But both Tanner Lee and Patrick O'Brien also looked impressive today. The two-lane transfer Tanner Lee tossing three touchdowns this afternoon. In a balanced effort on the ground today, a whole bunch of Huskers getting touches. 
and an impressive outing from Wyatt Mazur. Six carries, 60 yards, and a touchdown playing for both the red and white squads, and Divina Zigbo getting a score on the ground as well. And there's that guy again, Wyatt Mazur, this time on the top of the receiving list. Six grabs for 81 yards, and J.D. Spielman has been talked about all spring long. A solid effort from him today, four catches, 70 yards, including that 30-yard touchdown strike from Tanner Lee.